In this video, we are going to watch an amazing magic act performed by the Spanish magician Juan Luis Rubiales on the Fool Us show. And we will also learn the secret behind this magic trick. If you enjoy the video, please like it and support us. In this magic act, magician Juan, along with Penn and Teller, is on stage. Juan says he is going to perform a card trick and takes a card deck in his hand. He deals the cards onto the table and asks Penn to say stop at any point. When Penn says stop, Juan sets that card aside. Then it's Teller's turn. Juan deals the cards again and asks Teller to say stop at any point. When Teller says stop, Juan sets that card aside. Now, all the cards on the table are arranged in this manner. Juan says he will create exactly the same picture on the other side of the table. To do this, Juan first places a close-up magic pad on the table. He says he will magically produce cards on this pad. Juan takes a white ball in his hand, bounces it a few times, and amazingly, with each bounce, a card appears on the table. In this manner, Juan makes five cards appear on the table. Juan explains that producing the entire deck at this speed on live TV would take too much time, so he has done it in advance. He then spreads all the blank cards on the pad. Now, Juan takes a red ball in his hand and asks Penn to select any blank card. He does the same with Teller. Juan then says he will print the back design of the playing cards on the selected blank cards. He bounces the red ball on the blank cards, and indeed the back design of the playing cards appears on them. Next, Juan flips over the cards selected by Penn and Teller here, revealing the Four of Clubs and the Queen of Hearts. He says he will now print these cards on the other pad. Juan bounces the red ball on the blank cards, and amazingly, the cards turn into the Queen of Hearts and the Four of Clubs. The magic doesn't end there because Juan had said he would create the same image on both sides. For the image to be the same, the center cards should all be blank. When Juan turns over the center cards, everyone is astonished because all the cards are blank, making the left side exactly match the right side. But how? How does Juan produce cards with just a ball? And how do all the cards, except the ones chosen by Penn and Teller, turn out to be blank? Now we are going to reveal the secret behind this amazing magic trick. Before we do, if you enjoyed Juan Luis Rubial's incredible magic act, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more magic reveal videos. Let's uncover the secret behind this magic trick. In this act, Magician Juan first deals cards from a deck onto the table and asks Penn to say stop at any point. He does the same with Teller. When Penn and Teller say stop, Juan places those two cards on the table. It seems like Penn and Teller are freely choosing their cards, but in reality, these two cards are forced. When Juan deals the cards, he uses a technique called the second deal. In the second deal, the second card from the top is dealt, while the top card remains in place. The deck in Juan's hand is arranged in a specific way. In this deck, there are six blank cards on top of the deck, followed by the Queen of Hearts card and the Four of Clubs card at the very bottom. Additionally, all the cards in between are blank cards. When Juan deals the cards for the first time and asks Penn to say stop at any point, he actually deals the top six cards first so that no one becomes suspicious. As you can see here, he is dealing the cards from the top. After dealing six cards, he performs a second deal and places the cards on the table from here. When Penn says stop, Juan places this Queen of Hearts card from the top on the table. Now, Juan is left with the blank cards and the Four of Clubs at the bottom of the deck. Then, Juan shuffles the cards and cleverly brings the Four of Clubs from the bottom to the top. Once again, he deals the cards and asks Teller to say stop. As before, Juan uses the second deal, placing the blank cards on the table until Teller says stop. At that point, Juan places the top card, the Four of Clubs, on the table. 
This way, both cards are forced, and Juan knows exactly which cards they are. By using the second deal technique, Juan ensures that the Queen of Hearts and the Four of Clubs are the cards Penn and Teller choose. The rest of the cards remain blank, allowing Juan to create the stunning effect where only the chosen cards appear normal, and all others are blank. Now let's move on to the other part where Juan produces cards with the ball and prints them. Actually, Juan is not just holding a white ball. He also has five blank cards, which he skillfully places on the table in sync with the ball's bounce. This makes it look like the cards are appearing magically. If we watch in slow motion, we can notice the cards and the ball being coordinated. Similarly, when Juan takes the red ball in his hand, if you look closely, his right hand goes behind the table once more, where he takes two back design blank cards, one Queen of Hearts card and one Four of Clubs card into his hand. Just like before, he releases the back design cards in sync with the ball's bounce, creating the illusion that the back design of the cards is magically being printed. Immediately after this, he releases the remaining two cards palmed in his hand with the ball's bounce, making Pan and Teller's selected cards appear on the table. Seeing this, everyone is amazed, but now you know how it is done. We put in a lot of effort to bring you such amazing magic reveal videos, so please make sure to like the video. If you are new to this channel, subscribe and press the bell icon to receive notifications for all upcoming videos.